That's a great question I get all the time. The core is actually 30 muscles that make up your whole torso area. We call it the power pack because that's where all movement begins. When you're running, jumping, swinging, throwing, swimming, all movement begins in the torso, in the core area. That is why we train the core. And those 30 muscles, they wrap around your whole body, almost like putting a big thick belt around your body and tying it tight, and it supports you as well. The core also brings your upper body and lower body together. So think of this, when you're in the outfield or in the infield and a ball comes to you and you have to quick move laterally to your left or to your right, if you're not training your whole entire core, your body is actually going to react very differently than if you are training your core. You want your body to be like a pillar, a solid pillar. So if I need to go and move to my right really quick and I'm not training the core, my upper body goes, and then my lower body goes, and then eventually my core and my torso and my center of gravity will follow. But when you're training the core with these exercises in softball team training, when you react, you're gonna react as one. And guess what? It doesn't take long to see those differences. Get 10 free softball training videos plus 3 bonus workout video at www.softballteamtraining.com slash free.